So I'm going to start by have you, having you tell me your name and your position right now. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Jessica Watson, and I'm currently a deputy district attorney um, for the county of Humboldt. And I'm running for um, superior court judge. Got it. Okay. So then to start us off, tell me a little bit about yourself. Um, I came up to Humboldt County um, in 20... 20- Oh, three. So 2003. Um, I've been here for about 21 years, um, almost half my life. Um, I went to HSU. I graduated from HSU and then left to go to law school and then came back in 2012 um, to start practicing law. I've practiced criminal defense. I practiced some civil um, and I've more recently been at the district attorney's office um, for 10 years now um, or almost about 10 years. I think in April it'll be 10 years. Um, I have two young children and a husband who stays at home with them and um, I have given my career to serving the people of Humble County and I hope to continue to do so. Got it, awesome. Um, why should people vote for you? Um, people should vote for me because I am the best option. <laughs> I wasn't planning of on running at um, the primary election. Um, however, the thing that came out about the incumbent judge urged me to come forward and put my name in um, as a writing candidate um, because I think that Humble County deserves a better option than the two um, people running currently. Um, again, I've been here for 20 years. I um, enjoy Humble County. This is my home. Um, and I would love to be able to continue to serve the county in a capacity as a Superior Court Judge. Um, additionally, I am fair and reasonable and even tempered. Um, I can tell you that part of my campaign is I'm not taking any endorsements from anyone and I'm not taking any money from anyone, um, mostly because the best way to avoid um, the appearance of impropriety is not to actually create any conflicts in the community. Um, so my campaign is basically based on word of mouth. It is a solely grassroots campaign. Um, and if we go forward um, in the general election in November, I'm going to continue to go that route because I think it's important to um, the community, our community, to know that I am not um, biased towards any group of people. I'm not um, supportive of certain groups of people. Um, that sounds weird. <laughs> I'm not necessarily, um, I'm not going to be swayed by groups of people solely based on the fact that they endorsed me or voted for me. Um, I think that a judge should not have um, any of those conflicts um, when they take the bench. Got you. Okay. What are some of the things that you will bring to our community if you are voted in? I will definitely bring um, fairness. <laughs> I, um, in my courtroom, should I get elected, um, I want everyone to know that they will get a chance to be heard. Um, I think that a lot of times people leave court not understanding what happened, um, not understanding, um, or not feeling as though they've actually been heard by the person in charge, the judge. And I um, guarantee that if you are in my courtroom, I will listen to what you have to say. Um, I will take everything into consideration before I make a decision. And it won't be based on my own emotion or how I feel about a specific thing. It'll solely be based on the law that I've researched and the facts that I've heard. Got it. Thank you. Um, so that answers most of my general questions. Oh. Is there anything else that you'd like to add for our viewers? No, just write in Watson, <laughs> Jessica Watson. Um, for Superior Court Judge on March 5th. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you.